So since this uh, floor is concrete, we also got to do is put the hardwood in. 22-year-old Raynell entrepreneur Trey Yates is taking advantage of all opportunities that come his way to help rebuild his hometown. So whenever you get actually in here, we don't know the whole floor plan yet, but we know that we're going to make it to where a small family can actually come in and live in it. Just like many other businesses in Raynell, the motel was severely damaged by the 2016 flood. The once busy motel has been abandoned ever since. Uh, it's all about opportunity. I call West Virginia Opportunity State. Yates thought buying the motel and turning it into housing would be the perfect incentives for workers and future residents. A big economic guy. So therefore, when I say we need to bring jobs in, then you look at where, the, where these people will going to live. So you can balance that with saying we offer housing for our employees. So whenever that comes into play, actually having that, you can actually say jobs need to be here. Building homes is not the only thing the young businessman is doing. He's also providing jobs. All my business is being headquartered in Raynell and some actually going to be producing in Raynell. Like Greenbrier Dairy will have a butter and cheese plant on 8th Street, which is right across the road from where these apartments will be. So we can say you're going to have a place to live and you're also your work's going to be within walking distance. You don't have to worry about transportation. Reporting in Raynell for Newswatch, I'm Shakira Hawkins.